We had to move the company, our mission, to find a location for our North American headquarters where it cost less to do business. We did the research. We narrowed it down. Arizona, Florida, Illinois, New Jersey, Texas, and North Carolina. Then we called in the professionals, the Charlotte Regional Partnership. The orders came in. Our mission, make Charlotte USA the North American headquarters for Project U-Haul. I called the contact. They gave me the skinny. Then we rolled into action. We shot out a request to gather some intel. We bundled the info together and sent it out. Properties in several counties hit the mark. David Swenson called me from Charlotte Regional Partnership and asked if I could help with the project. He said it was going to be uh, Project U-Haul. From, from that detailed questions, I developed a list of properties that might fit with a map. It showed over 20 potential locations. Got back on the phone with the client, narrowed it down to about 12. They came to town a week later. We toured 12, narrowed it down pretty quickly to four or five. We needed the facts, salaries, taxes, cost of living, labor health insurance. We had actually just had a meeting with the Charlotte Regional Partnership the week before and I got an email to say that they had referred us to a new company and we had to prepare for the meeting with minimal information. It was highly confidential at this point. There really were a lot of moving parts on this case. We had the time crunch, we had the census being undefined, and then we had all the new plans for January. It took a lot of analyzing and strategic planning. So it was a lot of um, numbers and calculators were out and everybody had their pens out taking notes and you know the controller was running and crunching all kinds of numbers in his head. You could just see his brain working. But you can't just look at the bottom line. We had to have the workforce, they had to be skilled, and there had to be plenty of them. The first time I met with Project U-Haul was at the Charlotte Regional Partnership. I learned what they wanted. I only had a few months to uh, screen, and then after screening, I only had 30 days to deliver the goods. I did my homework. I conducted a market analysis. I used my extensive network. I also uh, developed a salary structure that modeled the Charlotte USA market. It looked good, but I don't count my chickens. Good thing, too. I thought I'd convinced them. Then spring came. Months passed, nothing. The project was in jeopardy. The international headquarters questioned the effectiveness and cost of moving away from an existing location. Charlotte USA sounded too good to be true. East Coast location? Nationwide air accessibility? Very competitive commercial rates? Reasonable housing costs? Good density and workforce? Even help moving in? We were determined to prove our case. We tapped the regional pros to get the right data to the right people at the right time. You gotta be competitive. It doesn't matter whether it's developing and making widgets or components and system solutions to transport data and energy like we do. My sources told me that many of our competitors had opened in North Carolina, so there had to be something to the hype. But I don't take anyone's word for it. I had to see for myself. We went. We saw. We talked. We moved. Charlotte would be getting the new headquarters and the great jobs. It felt great! Mission accomplished.